Hi, hello, welcome back to the vlog. I'm David Bailey, an Englishman in the Balkans. I'm still a bit chilly, I've not been too well recently. If you've been following me on the blog or Facebook or where else, um, you'll know that. But it's the last weekend of October and it's time for rakia. Rakia is made from all those lovely fruits in the orchards that people have out here in the countryside. About eight weeks ago, six to eight weeks ago, they were putting them into large plastic vats. Some may have wooden vats, uh, I don't know. All the fruit has been fermenting down and now it's time to distill it uh, into rakia. And rakia is a family name for spirits. So here rakia is normally made from um, plums, apples, pears, uh, there's a sort of grappa that is also distilled from grape and fruits from other unique parts of Bosnia such as something similar to cranberry is made not uh, too far away from us actually over towards uh, Croatia in the town of Derbar. So rakia is a bit like spirit so if you're um, a Western European it will be like the family name for whiskies and gins and brandies um, and vodkas. So over the last uh, couple of days uh, the neighbours here and everybody around has been congregating uh, around that still and taking their time to make some really, really first-class rakia. I often get asked uh, how strong rakia is, it's about 55%, but some people actually double distill it and well, that goes up to about 61%. So that's the annual rakia making for this season. Hope you enjoyed the video. Whether you see this on YouTube, on Vimeo, on IGTV, Facebook, or wherever, if you can share it, like it, comments always appreciated. Somebody said, can I come along and see it? Um, not sure if we're into doing guided tours at the moment, but maybe that's something to do um, in the future. Thanks again for watching, and I will catch you on the next one.